I've got the power. That's right, guys. I have the power baby. I've got all this power in my hand in a mod. This is the latest and greatest mod. This is the most incredible mod and the most unique mod I have ever used. It's incredible for a lot of reasons. Um, I wouldn't necessarily say it's the most incredible vape, but the vape is awesome. And uh, we're going to talk about the pros and cons, how it works, what it is. But this is by far one of the most unique mods I have ever used. Uh, and it is from NickFitNation.com. Um, I'm also proud to say I believe I am the first uh, person to do a video review on the Power Baby. And I'm one of the first five, I think, at least in Canada, to purchase a Power Baby. I bought this pretty much the day Nick Fit Nation released uh, about a dozen uh, for sale, and then they stopped, and now they're now they're fully for sale. I'm gonna put all the links in the description from NickFitNation.com uh, where you can buy the Power Baby. Uh, Power Baby. <laughs> but first, let's unbox this bad boy and see what comes with it. So. This is the box that it comes in. Very cool. Really nice packaging. It's a solid box. It's got this nice see-through here where you can see the Power Baby mod. And I guess in China, it is known as the VVPCCP. Uh, High-tech Chinese name for this mod. But we are now calling it the Power Baby. That's how it's been branded by Nick Fit Nation. It's got one of these really cool magnetic strippies here, which is nice. But what's nice is everything that comes inside of this box. And that's really what I love about this. So the first thing here is a full color instruction booklet with everything you need to know about the Power Baby. And it's in English. Um, not the greatest English, but this is a pretty straightforward device. Uh, pretty simple to use. Um, so the instructions, they do what they need to do. So it's great to get some English step-by-step -step, uh, instructions uh, on the Power Baby. It also comes with, obviously, the Power Baby mod. That's the most important piece in this kit. This thing is an absolute uh, beauty. It's really lightweight, feels really nice in your hand. It's easy to grip. It's got a beautiful black matte like finish to it. It's a really, really nice finish. Different than like the Ego matte finishes. I'd say it's a little smoother. And I've been using it for a while now and it really doesn't leave a whole lot of marks. Uh, it doesn't chip easily. At least I haven't found that yet. And I believe they come in multiple colors, but right now they're only being sold in black. And then there are three uh, connectors on the top here, there's the 510 or 808. Uh, there's a power uh, connector as well. There is a USB out. And then there is the uh, battery. Uh, you got your battery life in here. So we'll talk about all that later. And then the power button is on the side here and it's mechanical. So this is essentially a 5,000 ma power bank. This thing is awesome, and we're going to talk about all the cool features. So what else comes in the box? Two CE5 uh, Ego Clearomizers. These are the new ones with the interchangeable heads, so they unscrew at the bottom, and you can purchase new coil heads to put inside. You'll notice that they have the cigar tips to them and not the standard uh, tip that we usually see on Ego Clearomizers, and you get two of them, and they're long wicks. I'm not exactly sure what the ohms are on those. You get a bottle, an empty bottle with an injector tip so a needle tip a bottle which always comes in handy and then you get your charging cable it's a two-way USB uh, charging cable that comes with a couple different adapters uh, one obviously to charge your power baby and most importantly an iDevice uh, charger so this can be used for iPhones iPods iTouch iPad etc and we'll talk a bit about that later and why that is so cool so that is everything that comes inside of the box. So now let's talk about, oh, there's one other thing that comes inside the box. My bad, I just have it connected to my Power Baby right now. But this is probably the coolest, um, I guess you could say, accessory that comes uh, with it. You can see here this tip. This is a voltage regulator, and it's an Ego threaded uh, voltage regulator, and by pressing the button on here you get three different colors you get a blue a pink and a red and that's how you adjust the voltage so yes this is a variable voltage device but it only has by default 
uh, by default it only has one voltage so without the adapter it's a 5 volt device with the adapter you get a 3.3 a 4.0 and a 4.8 and basically when you press the button the light comes on you can change the light here and uh, adjust your voltage but we will go through all that in a second when we talk about how the power baby functions but first I want to talk about everything that comes in the box and I believe Vapor said he will be selling these adapters uh, separately uh, later on they're really cool I actually played around with this adapter and a couple other uh, devices I had some egos and some other 5 volt uh, well my egos are 3.7 but I put this on a 3.7 ego to see what would happen and it did change uh, the voltage on there so it's kind of a cool little adapter to have um, though if you're going to have an ego you may as well just get a twist if you really want those voltages but that's the only way you're going to get multiple voltages on the uh, power baby so yes technically it's not a variable voltage device but with this voltage regulator that's ego threaded it then becomes variable voltage you get four different volts and obviously for me you've heard me talk about it enough times absolutely essential to have that ego um, ego threads because ego uh, tanks like any kind of stardust clear miser are just so popular today I mean, I... all right so let's and um, let's talk about the pros and cons and see how it vapes and I'll show you how to use it so first charging it micro USB fits into here very simple so you got a, you got a micro USB port okay and then two USB now the other thing that you can purchase that you can get as a kit to go along with the power baby is something called the power daddy this is pretty cool this is another power bank so this is another 5000 ma uh, power bank and this is pretty cool you can use this to charge again any kind of i device or your power baby it has two USB outs, a 500 ma out and a 1A out. So a 32 pin, I believe it's a 32 pin, no sorry, 30 pin um, iPod, uh, iPhone, um, what am I talking about? That's the other end of it. These are the two USB, but it comes with a 30 pin uh, iPhone adapter and a bunch of other, actually you get a whole bag uh, of adapters that you can use for all kinds of different devices, which is pretty sweet. And I've used this bad boy a few times it's pretty freaking awesome. You charge it via USB, and then you can use it to charge other devices. And I was on conference for a week, and this thing is so light. I swear to God, it weighs like nothing, and it's thin, it's sleek, you know, fits in your pocket, in your bag, whatever. I use this to charge all my e-cigs uh, when I was on conference. So when I was at the booth, hidden in the back, I was charging egos, I was charging my power baby, I was even charging my iPhone and my iPads. It's just this, it's an awesome device. So to show you, in the combination here take this plug it into the USB out turn it on so you see it has its uh, its um, life indicator here so this is the battery indicator here three strips fully charged and then you'll see that the power baby is now charging and the power baby has multiple dots which indicate how much power five dots in total um, what's interesting is while this is plugged in um, you can actually fire this bad boy up and vape off of it while it's plugged into the power daddy. So if I were to put a card on here, so here's a Kanger. Okay. Got the power button here on the side. You press the power button, fires up. Oh, incredible. So much vapor, so much power. Um, you can vape while it's charging, so pretty sweet. So let's take a look at how the device actually works now. So that's the Power Daddy and Power Baby combo. So you don't necessarily need both, but I've kind of fallen in love with the Power Daddy. I think it's a great device. Okay, so voltage regulator and the Power Daddy. So Power Baby. So as you can see, it's got a 510 or 808 connection. You screw in this regulator here. When you press and hold the power button, so there's the power button on the side, you press and hold, it lights up. That's blue, if I press it again, pink, and then red. So those are my different voltages. Blue is 3.3 volts, pink is 4.0 volts, and red is 4.8 volts. So you get a 3.3, 4.0, 4.8, and without the adapter, it is five. Okay, so you have 
four different voltages on here. I've played around with quite a few devices on here from VV Novas to Stardusts uh, to Cardos and um, I'm loving the pink. I'm staying in the pink which is the 4.0 area seems to work best for most though I find the Kangers perform better on the uh, 3 3.3 voltage. I'm not sure why. Um, I think they're just, you know, the Kangers are very powerful <clears throat> and very warm vape anyways, and I find they perform best on that lower voltage on the Power Baby, that is. So let's take a look at how this vapes. Mm. Wonderfully. So much vapor, lots of flavor. Um, again, feels comfortable in the hand. It's easy to use. It's pretty awesome. Though I've really fallen in love. This is my combo on here now. My combo is a VV Nova on the pink. So the um, 4.0 voltage. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. So good. Chocolate mint. Absolutely loving it. It is an incredible vape. And again, even with that VV Nova on here, still pretty light. Um, it's just such a, a sweet device. Um, the other great thing I found about this, because I traveled recently through airports, is that if you don't have a tank on here, it's basically just a power bank. No one is going to stop you or even question you as to what it is. And if they do, you just say, it's a power bank. Look, USB connections, micro USB connections. I use it to power my iPhone. I use it to power my iPod. Nobody asks any questions. They ask you why you got two power banks. You tell them you're a techno junkie and you need lots of power. We all need power. <laughs> so it's been working really um, great for me. I've had a few, um, I, could, I guess you could say, interesting um, little issues. Nothing major though. Um, for starters, I find when, so when you press it once, press the button once, it will show you your battery life. So currently... This needs a bit of a charge, actually. So I'm on I'm on three dots instead of five dots. So it definitely needs to be charged up. Um, but I found that sometimes you really need to press and hold that button. And you see even sometimes the light blinks a little. It's not necessarily a misfire, but you really need to press and hold that button sometimes. What's interesting is as the power gets lower on here, I found as um, the power baby has less power left in it, um, it kind of does misfire. What happens is the vol or maybe this is an issue with the voltage regulator, but the light will start to flicker a little. I got to stop and start again. I've actually had it turn off on me twice now. Pressed, went to take a vape, and it just shut off. And I reset it by uh, plugging it back in. So you can reset it by plugging this first into your USB and then plugging this into here. Light will come on, pull it out, and it resets it, and it seems to work fine. That happened to me twice, but in all fairness. That happened to me with Kangers. I've been finding, for some reason, the Kanger Cardos keep causing those weird glitches with the voltage regulator and the power baby. So when I'm using the Kanger Cardos, sometimes I get those flickering lights, uh, the quote-unquote misfires, or uh, a total shutoff. Have not had that happen to me with a Stardust or a VV Nova. So I'm not sure uh, what that's all about. So pretty sweet device. Um, pretty sweet device. I mean, it's 5,000 ma. I successfully vaped this for almost three days straight as my uh, main device, and it, it held out. Um, I went, well, almost three days. I guess probably more like two and a half days. Still, though, that's pretty awesome to go about two and a half days on uh, one device. Most of us can't say that we can do that even on an 18650 ma. Uh, you know, uh, mod, we still can't go for about two and a half days unless you're not using it exclusively. And I was basically using this exclusively. <clears throat> Maybe I took a vape here and there off one of my egos or something lying around. But I got to tell you, since I've had this device, I haven't touched. I got a shelf over here. I've got like two lava tubes, an Omega, a Prodigy, a Twist, other egos. I mean, I got a ton of mods just sitting over there. And I don't even use them. I haven't used them since I got the Power Baby. I'm pretty much addicted to the VV Nova uh, Power Baby combo at 4.0 volts. This has become my vape. I can't vape without it. In fact, 
when I know this thing is starting to die, I just freaking plug this in and like get me some more power because I don't want this sucker uh, to die me. I mean, if I have to, I'll go back to my twist, but uh, it's just so powerful. It just feels so good. Uh, you get like, I mean, yes, partially it's the devices, but good throat hit, great vapor, uh, performs well. I mean, it is brand new. So like I said, there are those minor glitches, but it's totally worth it, and I'm sure it is going to get better. I mean, this is only the first version. I'm sure they're going to come out with other versions. I know they've already made some changes. The newest version has uh, plugs to go in here and other things like that. Let me just take another vape again off here to show you. Mm. So good. I want you to hear the crackle on here. Because it's loud. All right, and if I, I mean, listen to that crackle. I don't want to burn out my, my tank, but just incredible. Even at blue, which is 3.3 .3 volts. Mm. Still such an incredible vape. So, I mean, that's the Power Baby. Once again, the Power Baby mod from Nick Fit Nation comes with two ego clearizers, a voltage regulator that's ego threaded for 3 volts, 3.3, 4.0, 4.8. By default without the regulator, it's a 5 volt. Comes with a two-way USB charging cable that is capable of charging your iPhone, iPad, iTouch. You know, I should real quickly here, I want to show you because it's it's pretty cool. So, I'm just going to put the iPhone adapter in here. Boom going to plug this into the USB out on my power baby and I'm going to plug that into my iPhone so watch the screen light up boom charging and oh mm, 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 mm. look at that I'm charging and vaping how freaking cool is that is that a necessity? No. Is it awesome? Yes. So this is definitely a unique vi a device. And that's why I said this is by far the most unique device um, that I have ever used. Uh, I cannot say I've ever used a device that is nearly as unique as this when it comes to uh, vaping. And it works. Like I said, one or two minor glitches. It misfires. Um, with my Kanger Cardos and I get a blinking regulator and sometimes and it shut off on me twice But I was capable of uh, resetting it really quickly by plugging it into the USB other than that I've had no problems with this device at all feels great in my hand looks good vapes good Takes photos. Well, I mean all my Instagram photos are pretty awesome So there you have it the power baby not a true variable voltage mod It'd be nice one day to see maybe a screen on here, you know and for you to be able to change the voltage you know, incrementally and maybe see your ohms, etc. like like you would on something like a lava tube or a VMAX or a Provari, etc. But it's a nice little mod. Uh, looks like a box mod, but not a box mod. Um, and it's just pretty cool. So that's the Power Baby from Nick Fit Nation. I'm sorry this video took so long, but there's so many features. Um, I really hope I haven't missed anything. I'll put the links in the description. Check it out. It is definitely a great vape. I'm going to bring this with me to the next Montreal vape meet. So if you're from Montreal, be there. Try it. Vape it. It's awesome. And I'm going to leave you with one more toot. Mm -mm -mm. Keep on vaping. And remember, I've got the power.